Uh, my background, I, I was uh, born and raised in France. Uh, my mother is, is French and my uh, father is Vietnamese. Um, so it was, uh, I was 21, uh, uh, I was 21, I was a student in literature. Um, I was planning to become a, a French teacher. Um, but I could feel it wasn't really, you know, it wasn't so much so exciting, even if I was really passionate about literature. Before that, I, I, uh, I study um, politics, uh, but I could still feel it wasn't, you know, my way. And uh, I was very shy and uh, in the same time very um, interested about um, uh, you know, new experience, especially about sex, because I started my uh, sexual life very late. So as I was shy and as I liked challenge, I started to go go dance in clubs. To like, it was like a way to fight against uh, the fact that I was shy. And um, I met a photographer of the magazine Penthouse France, who asked me if I was interested in modeling, and I said, okay, why not? Because at this, you know, I was just like, okay, let's try. <laughs> I was young <laughs> and very curious about everything, so I said yes, and very quickly asked me if I was interested about um, maybe uh, doing porn, and for me it was like a big joke because I, for sure, I wasn't made to do porn, I was too shy, I had no experience, I had a lot of, I mean, a lot of taboo, and at the same time I was, it could turn me on, but really I wasn't confident. But I said, okay, let's try. It's it's like a game, and it's yeah, it's funny, you know. So I tried really because it was uh, sexually exciting, and as soon as I did my first scene on camera, I could feel that I really loved it. That was very strange because right away, uh, the fact that I was on camera, I could feel confident. So I kept doing uh, scenes by signing a contract, an exclusive contract with Penthouse. I really didn't want to be famous or to have a career, I just wanted to keep uh, studying um, and doing scenes, like to have a, a double life. <laughs> it was very exciting to, to have two lives. And, um, and finally I, I decided after two years to stop uh, studying because to become a teacher wasn't <laughs> definitely wasn't, my, um, wasn't made for me. I'm very, very happy. I, um, I work with Marc Dorsel. Uh, so Marc Dorsel is the number one company in France, but also in Europe. And we are now uh, starting a collaboration where I start directing for them. It seems that it sells very well, so it was a good start. And um, Dorsel was happy, so they gave me a budget to direct my first feature that I did a few days ago. And this time I can say I'm happy. So I launched Potica two years ago in France, uh, Germany, Australia have now distribution in Italy and uh, I'm working right now on my uh, new collection which will be uh, available in the US. So I'm very happy and uh, it's, yeah, it takes time, you know, I do it, it's very slow because, because I do it myself. Um, so as I have uh, many other things like, you know, directing and writing and, and doing scenes also as a performer because I still do scenes, um, I, I, I don't develop the company the way I would like. Uh, maybe, maybe I should uh, hire some people. <laughs> maybe it's time for me to, yeah, to, to have more employees. Uh, but for sure, if it's going slow, it's going you know, it's going very, very well. I won't lie, awards mean something to me. Um, even today, even if I got many, many awards in my career, um, even if I know that it won't change my career, that, you know, I will, it won't stand, it, it won't change the way I work. Uh, um, but still, yeah, it means something. I'm happy when I have an award. It's, we are already in March, can you believe that? It goes too fast. Uh, 2012 is a very important year for me because I need to accomplish new things, uh, have new challenges, so 
yes, to direct for sure, uh, to keep developing petit cœur, petit cœur And uh, this year, I feel that it's really um, a good year to write <laughs> because, I, as I told you, I write for two uh, mainstream uh, magazines in France um, for their websites. And I feel more and more confident about uh, about that. People really enjoy uh, reading my articles, and you know it's a good surprise. So, so yeah, I want to do more.